Hi, welcome to Wise Guides. Graphing function using table of values and by scientific calculator. Here is an example. Now, I'm going to graph a quadratic y equal 2x squared plus 5x minus 3. And then regularly we use the light and we use several points, say x equal negative 5. You will use calculate, you can enter 2 times negative 5 squared plus 5 multiply negative 5 minus 3 equal 22. And when you enter x equal negative 4 to find the y value, you need to reduce this one. Like you have y equal 2 times negative 4 square plus 5 times negative 4 minus 3. Then you got the answer. You got your answer equal 9, right? Now, using calculator and using CALC button. So we don't need enter every time. So I will show you. First we enter the function, which is 2x squared plus 5x minus 3. We enter the function when you enter x. Right? You need alpha x because the red alpha will go with red x, which is the bracket this x. But now if we we can enter all this one, complete this one, y equals this one. So y is the comma button on the top of this one. When you hit the alpha, when you hit the alpha, Okay, when you hit the alpha button, then hit the comma button, which is y, it show you y. The equal sign is not the this equal sign, not the, not the, we use this equal sign, but use the, this equal sign, which you press alpha, then C-A-L-C. Alpha C-A-L-C. So, can you see? Alpha C-A-L-C, it show you the equal sign. Then we enter the function 2x squared, which is alpha, comma button x squared, and then we plus 5x, which is alpha, this one, and minus 3, minus 3. We enter function. Then we check every time we check the using C A L C button say they ask you what x? X equal negative five. We enter negative five, they give you twenty-two, and we enter C A L C negative four, they give you nine. We can enter now enter negative three, hit the this button, negative three, they give you zero. Zero. Then enter negative two equal. See, because I forget hit the C A L C button, then negative two it is negative two, which is wrong. So in this situation, we don't need erase everything. We go back here, right? Go back this arrow. Then you redo it. So C A L C button. Negative two. There you go. Give me negative five. Then C A R C button. Negative one. Negative six. And C A R C button zero. Negative three. And C A R C button one. Four. C L C button two fifteen and C A L C button three 
30. And CALC button 4, 49. But those points, that's enough to, to the graph, OK? So this is a much faster. Just remember, every time, before you enter the x value, you need to hit the CALC button, OK? Then we have all the data will go to the graph here, right? We enter the number here. We already have this number, which is 95 is 22. 95 is 22. This is 10. This is 22. This one, 22 here. This is 20, 22. And 94 is 9. 94 is 9 here is 8. This is 9. Negative 3 is 0. Negative 3 here is 0. Negative 2 is negative 5. Negative 2, this is a negative 3 is a 0, should be here. 3 is 0. Negative 2 is negative 5. This is a negative 2. Negative 4, negative 6. Negative 5 here. Right, this one. So negative two is negative one is negative six, negative one is negative six, which is this point. And zero is negative three. Zero is negative three. Here is negative three here. And one is four. One is four. And two is fifteen. Two is fifteen. And the 3 is 30, 3 is 30 here. That's enough, we can factor it, right? We can uh, graph it. So, and 4 is 49, we don't have enough space, but uh, it's okay. This way we can join all the point, this one here. This one. Mm. Right. If you want to make this as a more perfect, you can choose negative six. You can choose, say. And the six and thirty nine. Yeah. And the six you go to thirty nine, right? Then you can go to six thirty nine here. This is a thirty two, thirty four, thirty five, thirty thirty six, two, four, six, eight, nine here. Almost here. See? Almost there. Yeah. Can you go? Yes, we just a go. Just go a little bit, right, yeah. So, this is show you how to use the scientific calculator to find using table of value by using calculator, using this button.